Hi there, welcome to Dear Cyber Sue Advice Show. Today's topic is, if your partner keeps pulling away from you, let them go. Now what I'm talking about here is if your partner keeps playing games with you or, or saying to you, oh yeah, well, I don't know about a future, I'm not sure if I'm ready for a relationship, all these things, and they're keeping you on edge, you're always feeling like you're tiptoeing around and wondering what's going to happen next time you talk to each other. You just don't get where you're going and you've been with them for a while. If they keep doing this to you, you're never going to feel secure with them. Ask yourself why you want to be with somebody who isn't there for you 100% of the time. They're there part time. They give you little pieces of themselves. One day you feel like, oh wow, this is great. Everything's going fantastic. And I can see ourselves together in the future. And then the next day they turn around and they're wishy-washy about their feelings towards you. Or they want to take a break. Well, a lot of people who've watched me on a regular basis on YouTube here know how strongly I feel about taking a break. Because I feel if you take a break in a relationship or your partner wants to and you're not on the same page with them, break it off because they're just not ready to be there and they're going out to see what else is out there on this break to decide if they want to stick around. Well, they should know. If you're in a relationship with somebody, they should always know that they're there and you should feel that they're there and vice versa. You should give them the same security when you're in a relationship that you show them how you feel as well. So a lot of times people play games. So they're not really trying to push you away, but they kind of want their cake and eat it too. So if they push you a little bit away this way, they have a little bit more freedom to do things they want to do. Because you're sitting there living on the edge of waiting for them to make a decision on whether you're going to see them or if you're going to go away for the weekend, all these things. If people are, are keep pulling on you this way and you don't know which way your relationship is going from one day to the next, you have to ask yourself, why are you there? What's in it for you? What are you getting out of this? Like, how do I know? Like, how do I know if this is real? There is just simple stuff that happens. It flows, it's smooth. You respect each other's time, you respect each other's dislikes and likes, you compromise together, you work on things together. If somebody keeps playing this, this push and pull game with you all the time, they're just, they're just trying to be in control. They're trying to own you in a sense. Because holding on tighter than, to them just gives them more power, more control to do it more to you because they get all this, this stuff that happens that they go, wow, okay, this person likes me even more when I treat them like this. So you're not really setting a really good precedence here if you keep allowing them to treat you this way. So please respect yourself all the time. And if your partner is playing push-pull, I would just say let them go because they're not ready. It doesn't make them a horrible person. They may just, just not be ready to commit and they're just sort of playing these games to get what they can out of it. So that's my advice. And um, anybody else who has any questions, that was a great question from one of my viewers. I really thank you for that. Please subscribe to Dear Cyber Sue on YouTube here. Please comment. I love hearing what you have to say. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Thanks everyone. Bye -bye.